Hello guys. Today I got a couple things from Menards. See? Say big money in Menards. And these awesome things are something I can put up on the fixture. Up oh, there goes the bag. Here's okay, so first is a new halogen ball, it's an echo halogen, if I'm pronouncing it right. And the second is quite interesting, it's original, vintage, it's vintage style bowl. That looks awesome. And I wanna see what they look like. And I put them up here. First things first, I'm gonna start with this one, okay? Give me a sec. So, Two incandescents right there, two LEDs. I'm gonna take one of each and just put random the ones up there randomly. That's what it looks like with them off with the CFL incandescent LED, LED incandescent. I'm gonna put these both in and see the difference of the lights. Starting with this one. Let's take this one out. And yes, I am a big light bulb collector. It's gonna be like a Menards light in here. It's so shiny. I'll take it out of the box. Got it. Got it. And it is. Around, uh, it can handle 120 volts, but it's like 43 watts. What it says, see what it looks like turned on. Oh my gosh. That's the new bulb right there. Taking power! Alright, now I'm gonna put this one up in there. So, let me see. Have to turn it off so it doesn't get too hot. Well, it's an LED, but they still get hot circuits. First thing right now, ask me that why that song's in my head. Alright, get this out. I might keep the box, it looks so cool. Like, read this. In 1879, Thomas Edson, which was the inventor of the very first light bulb, but it's on every box, I believe. You can read it. I'll decide as I'm taking it out. But yeah, believe it or not, this was made in 1879, and it says vintage, so this is probably like over a hundred years old. This bulb right here, I'm gonna see, it has a good sock, it has the same socket, so I'm gonna see what it's like. I don't know if it'll be easy to keep this box now, but I'm pretty sure I can put it back together and read it. Got the LED bulb out. Let's put it in. Don't spin on me, you fixture, you stupid chandelier. Chandelier! Alright. Just like that. It's sticking out one of the longest light bulbs in there. So. Let's try it. And there it is. New one, old one. And they work great. And there's still an LED. And then a normal incandescent CFL halogen and the vintage fashioned, which is cool. And I'll just save, there's an LED and an incandescent right here. I'm just going to save those for in case what I most likely expect is one of these to burn out because these ones are obviously brand new. Well, this one. It was vintage and this one's brand new and this one can last forever. Not for a, but a very long time. So, as far as I know. That. Well, thanks for watching. Um, wait. Oh, figured I should read it. So, it's ripped up so I'll read it for you guys. In 18... 1879, Tom Ed... Tom Edson, I think is how you pronounce it, invented the light bulb by a small 
carbonized electricity is small filament. And man, it's ripped up. A vacuum tube inside a inside a glass globe. A vacuum inside a glass globe was able to produce the reliable, long-lasting source of light, which means it's long-lasting. The original carries on with the tradition of the first light bulb. Perfect for all visible bulb applications, and that's what it said in case you're curious. This one... It's funny. This one's not even ripped up. But, good. I don't think this is anything interesting to read, but here it is. Pause it if you want to. This will focus in. It's just showing you caution, you should not use that in different languages. Like, don't put it where it could start a fire. But this should be fine. Interesting. I will record it later in the dark. 